guys welcome back to my channel in today's video we are diving into the samsung frp bypass if you have recently reset your device and found yourself locked or due to a google account requirement don't worry we are here to help we will walk you through the step to bypass FRP on your Samsung device ensuring you can regain access without losing your data this method is for personal use only so make sure you are using its own device let's get started friend friend this video is especially for A05s and A05 so let's start the tutorial first of all go to Wi-Fi network and connect a Wi-Fi network without Wi-Fi network this method is not working on your phone then go to this setting option and then go to there the option is the text shortcut option and choose the plus option now enter the www.google.com And now enter the code star hajj star hajj and now right enter there and now go to the start button and write the change your language right now friends your language is the english tell ya now click to emergency call option and star hajj star hajj now testing menu is open Look, and now go to this loop back section and start rcb and then go to the start sp key now stop now go to this vibration option and wait 5 seconds during this process after 5 seconds then go to this black option after 5 seconds click to power button and back button now friends you can see that start button and agree set up manually and click to now go to this add network option and right there samsung frp bypass FRP by pass now go to this view more option IP setting statics and now the 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 .8 .8 .8 and now change the gateway 4 and now change your DNS to settings 8.8.4.4 .8 now go to this save option okay friend now and after completing this process go to home button and open talkback for 5 seconds use and draw again do the same things ok friend now wait 5 seconds on this page and after 5 second friends now use your another phone this is my Motorola phone and now turn off this talk back after turn off this talk back click back and now open this Motorola phone first of all you or you install a app first of all you go to play store and download the samsung smart switch mobile phone after after that now click on the start option click to agree option and wait 10 to 15 seconds on this page now you can see that there is a message around in my phone to set up so 
click on the setup option to transferring data from one device to another device. Now friends wait few seconds this may take a few moments. Scan the QR code. Now click to verify it's you. Click. Keep both devices on and close to each other until setup is complete. If you turn off any device, this process is not working in your phone. So making sure don't turn any phone, don't turn off any phone. Now copy data from your Android device. Google service. Now you can see that a new Gmail ID is at my Samsung phone with the I am not enter my email ID and password but you can see that the Motorola Gmail ID is transferred to Samsung phone. It means we are successfully pass FRP on my Samsung phone. Now click to more and more and click to accept option. Now click skip and skip anywhere. Don't skip the video. Setup is not complete properly. So please don't skip the video. Now click skip and skip. And don't touch this phone. If you touch this phone, this method is not working. Now click OK. Just a moment. Getting your phone ready friends. Please wait a few seconds. Forget password or don't set up later in settings. Now click on the skip option and skip option and agree option. Choose your display with next. The now next and finish. After clicking finish, complete setup message is removed automatically in my Motorola phone. So don't after that you can remove this phone now click to agree option choose your language now click continue skip option and skip option friends now install and finish finish now setup is completely uh, completely successfully in my Samsung phone and FRP is also removed okay friends if any case your phone is not unlocked so please comment with your model number thank you for watching